All right, guys, it's the Electric Scooter King here coming to you with some safety tips for riding in winter time. Okay, we got five of them today. We're going to talk about them. We're going to break them down. Um, I just filmed this video, but sure enough, my audio wasn't recording, so that wasn't fun. But um, yeah, we're getting back into it. So um, number one, wear your helmet. You should always be doing this 24-7. You should always have a helmet on, especially if you're riding a bike that it doesn't matter how many miles per hour it gets to or whatever. Wear your helmet. It saved my life like four times already. So please, guys, wear your helmet. Also, too, I recommend if you got like a ski mask to wear over your helmet, it just keeps your head a lot warmer in the winter time. It's just a lot. It's a lot better. Um, and then number two, right, we got gloves and even self-heating gloves, okay? Um, I just had gloves for me in the wintertime. My commute, luckily, was only like, let's say, 10, 20 minutes, so it wasn't that far for me. Um, I definitely recommend self-heating gloves. They're a little bit more expensive, but they're usually all of them are rechargeable, Um it just helps a lot in the winter time, you know, like your hands are going to get cold. Um, if you got self heating gloves though, you should be good. So, um, just make sure you get a good pair of gloves. Um, I also recommend too, and I'll talk about this too later on is jackets. They have jackets that like have, um, there's like a, it's like a piece of cloth that goes over your hand that you could wear with it also. So you could wear that with your glove. So you guys should be good on that part. Another thing too is slime, slime, slime. Make sure your tires are slimed. Make sure you got slime on you. Nobody wants to try to fix a flat tire when it comes to, you know, winter time. It's freezing. Okay. Um, another thing too for number four is bike maintenance. Okay. We know that there's a lot of salt, especially if you live in the Northeast, there's a lot of salt and stuff like that in the wintertime because we got to salt our roads. That stuff will eat away at your bike if you don't pay attention to it. Um, you got to make sure that, you know, you're checking your chain, making sure there's not any like big pieces of salt. If there is salt on it, I recommend cleaning it off and then just, you know, relubing the chain. You, so you should be good. But also, too, that stuff will eat away at, like, anything else on your bike. So just make sure you're doing that. And number two for number four is uh, make sure you're cleaning, right? And then make sure you're checking the bolts, making sure all your bolts are tight. I don't know why, but for me in the wintertime, it seemed like my bolts would get loose all the time. I don't know why. Uh, just make sure everything on your bike is nice and tight. Just do, like, a quick check every now and then. Keep a tool on you. Just go in and check that. And for number five, guys, one of the most important ones is take it slow. You got to take things slower in the wintertime. You could fall. You could hurt yourself. There's a lot that can happen in the wintertime. And I'll tell you one thing. From my experience, falling in the wintertime is never fun. Okay, I feel like it just amplifies everything. So you want to make sure that you're taking things slow. Then we'll talk about some conditions where, you know, you definitely want to get an Uber. You want to get an Uber during snowstorms, right? It's not fun to ride a bike in a snowstorm. Don't do it. Um, anytime it's like super raining and ice in the wintertime, that's not good. Um, and another time too is extreme cold. You don't want to ride in the extreme cold. You could have issues with like your battery and stuff like that. It's not fun. Don't do it. You guys will know when it's extreme cold, when you walk outside and you're like, holy moly. Um, and then my final tip is make sure you get a good jacket, right? I was just talking about, I wish I didn't lose the video, but I was talking about how in the wintertime, my legs and my feet usually didn't get that cold in the wintertime. So I just had a really good jacket that kept my upper body completely warm. But make sure you get a good jacket, wear some layers, you'll be good. But anyways, guys, it's the Electric Scooter King signing out. Just giving you guys some good tips for, you know, riding in the wintertime. You know, not all of us, you know, some of us use these bikes to commute every day. And I'm sure some of you guys are using this every day. And you're like, hey, maybe I want to use it in winter. These are some tips for you guys, okay? 
But anyways, guys, this is the Electric Scooter King signing out. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also, to anything you guys buy in my description is supporting my channel, so I appreciate that. Um, I'm going to start working a little bit more on my website, trying to get some more things in tuned. Um, but mostly, too, I've been, I'm going to try working on my TikTok, going live more, answering questions for you guys. So just trying to help everybody out. Um, we got to grow this channel, guys. We're growing. We're growing pretty good, pretty fast. We got to keep it going. But anyways, guys, it's the Electric Scooter King signing out.